Moving up also is uh, Garley Skipper from New Zealand. Butcher's mate goes up in three. Four rates up near the gate and Screaming Eagle on the fence. Riverly Jack's broken into a gallop on the second row and he's dropped right out of it. Stand by, blue light, they're off and racing now. Our maestro began fairly on the outside, but Thor Rates going quickly and will cross straight to the judge past the, uh, uh, on the rail, past the judge's box the first time from Butcher's Mate and Screaming Eagle on the inside. Earth Station got through the field to be one out and one back and they were followed by Rockley Victory on the inside then Rolliella. A length and a half further back in the field is Gaelic Skipper with about three lengths further back, our maestro. A break of about four lengths further back behind him, Bol Sharvard and three quarters of a length to Rivoli Jack, who's about 35 five metres off the leader. Down the back straight and Hancock is getting it easy on Thor right in the first lap and he leads by a length and a half. Butcher's mate is second and a half a length on the inside is Screaming Eagle. One out and one back Earth Station. Three quarters of a length back on the inside is Rockley Victory then a half a length on the outside to Rolliella. They were followed the length and a half further back in the field then in next person by Gaelic Skipper. A neck back on the inside is our maestro. A length off on the outside next of all Bull Sharvet and the length and a half to Riverley Jack. They come around the home turn just before the battle and it's Thor Rate. Untroubled in front from uh, on the outside, Butcher's Mate, Screaming Eagle the rail. Earth Station fourth, followed by Rockley Victory, then Rolliella. Our Maestro the rail, followed by Gaelic Skipper, then Bol Sharvet and Riverley Jack. At the bell, they come down to the judges' box and it's Thor Rate the leader, going to the 800 metre mark and travelling easily. Thor Rate from New South Wales and representing Tasmania, Brian Hancock, the driver from New South Wales. It leads by a length from Butcher's Mate on the outside and a half a length on the inside to Screaming Eagle. Earth Station's had a lovely run, hooking out three wide, Rolliella, but Earth Station's trying to come out from underneath it, back on the inside to Rockley Victory. They were followed further back by Gaelic Skipper and the next one, our maestro, followed by Bol Sharvet and the last one, still Riverly Jack. 500 metres left to run and Thor Raid has been joined by Butcher's Mate, but Thor Raid is battling on strongly on the inside and beats off Butcher's Mate. Rolliella's coming four wide round Earth Station and they were followed by Screaming Eagle on the rail. In a pocket back behind them, Rockley Victory and they were followed by Gaelic Skipper around the home turn with 200 metres left to go and Thor Rate's given them the go by it slipped away by two and a half lengths Thor Rate looks to have it won Screaming Eagle battling on on the inside Rolliella wide out and coming home quickly as Rockley Victory on the outside he's storming home but Thor Rate's too good Thor Rate wins by a length and a half Rockley Victory a half a length back Rolliella Screaming Eagle possibly fourth on the inside from wide out coming home quickly was uh, Gaelic Skipper they were followed further back in the field by El Maestro then Butcher's mate Riverly Jack Earth Station further back behind them and the last one home is Bol Sharvet. So that's the running of the first heat and as expected the brilliant Tasmanian pacer Thor Rate from the stables of Brian Hancock from Sydney proving too good for them. Had an easy run in the early part of the race, gave them the slip on the home turn and uh, halfway down the straight is about two and a half to three lengths in front. That's Rockley Victory in the gold colours flashing home on the outside to grab second spot and Rolly Eller inside it in third position. A brilliant pace of Thor Rate, winning the first heat and gaining 11 points. Number 12 is Rockley Victory and a half a length back on the inside of it, Rolly Eller third. And the one on the outside is the New Zealander Gaelic Skipper number six.